Hey guys, Substantial back here with another video. So today I'm gonna go in and do a drift build. Uh, yeah, so it was one of the best viewed videos on my channel at the moment. Uh, that was the RX7 drift build that I did. I was very happy with it, with how it um, how it was presented and how it performed. So I'm gonna go back in and do another one of them builds. Um, I think I'm. I think I know what car I'm gonna do. I wanna surprise you. Um, it's not Japanese, and uh, that's the only clue I'm gonna give you. Mm, it's a Mercedes. Oh, it turns out I haven't bought it. I thought I bought it. So yeah, uh, the drift car that I wanna to do today is a Mercedes. Uh, I'm not sure on the model, all I know is what it looks like. This is the one, the 190E 2.5 16 valve Evolution 2. I think it looks fucking sick with a big square spoiler on the back and just how 90s retro it looks. So we're going to go in and buy it and we're going to make it a drift car. Now upgrades cosmetically and physically i don't know what you can actually do to this car so it's going to be a first time experience me going in and upgrading it so let's get into it so i'm going to go to the garage upgrades and tuning custom upgrades first of all have we got a body kit no we haven't got a body kit uh engine i reckon we can do something with this engine um, I could put a single turbo on it, so does that mean it's a twin turbo? No. Right, so we can put a single turbo on it and see how that performs. Uh, drive train, we'll leave that alone. Oh, we can't actually do any body mods to it. Yeah, I'm, I don't want to put neither of them on. So, uh, cosmetically, there's nothing to do. Uh, we're going to extend the rear tire width I want to change the wheels I'm going to put some 52 wheels on uh, just because I think they're a good drift wheel uh, Ken Block uses them on all his cars and yeah I like to use them on my drift builds so we're going to go into the drivetrain and I'll upgrade the clutch to a maximum the differential and all that and then we want to go over to brakes and suspension. We want to put race brakes on it. We want to put um, drift springs, anti roll bars. Now, I I usually put a roll cage on if it has better stats. In this case, it it makes the stats go better, so I'm going to put the roll cage in. Uh, weight reduction always good so yeah we're gonna upgrade now this is this determines how much skids we're gonna get the fun part so uh, the turbo I thought the turbo might have gone up a bit more so, uh, we're just gonna upgrade all of this see what power I can get out of it if I feel like if it's not enough power I will do an engine swap so what does that leave us with 558 brake horse um, well I mean it still accelerates pretty quick so I think I'm going to leave that with this one um, so yeah uh, this is a part where I tune now it usually does take me a long time to tune so I'm going to fast forward through this bit so just so you don't have to painstakingly wait for me uh, tuning at all so yeah I will see you once I've done
okay guys so that's me back from tuning the car uh, now I have got a map here that people's recommended me different routes to go on and try drift uh, so I'm going to try a few of them out uh, so I'm going to go to the first one uh, which is not far from where I am now uh, so they say you start off about here and I'll show you whereabouts uh, to go so yeah I think this will actually be quite a good drift car to be honest with you um, Mercedes are known for handling and performance so yeah let's uh It, I'm not going to lie, it, it drifts a bit slow, but it handles really well. Yeah. I, I like it. I like it. Oh, this is going to be a good contender for the RX-7 for my favourite drift car. You had to fuck it up for me, didn't you, car? I fucking hate that when you're on a good drift tandem and fucking the car comes and fucks you up. I like how you can hear the turbo, you can hear the turbo flutter. I like it, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't, I didn't know whether, I was very unsure whether it was going to be. I know this car was made to tr uh, be a track car, uh, which is why I thought it'd be a good uh, contender, uh, be a good car to do a drift build on. Oh, 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 it's, it's taking the bend so well. Oh, let's go. Hot boy. I think I love it. I love it. Loving it, loving it, loving it. No, missed that corner, did I? Yeah, I like it. I like the sound of it. I like how it handles. Yeah. Now, I'm going to go take it to a, another place that I've been recommended to take to because that was a good drift zone to take on. Um, right. So, I'm just looking at my maps now. Um, this one looks like a good one. So over the other side of the map, it is. Hmm. It's over here. Sorry, I'm just trying to find it. Ah, uh, so it's here, that's why I couldn't find it. Right, so here it is. 
so yeah i've really enjoyed this drift uh, this drift build um if you want to see me do another drift build on a particular car that you want me to do then just comment down below what car it is i honestly don't mind doing it you know i like the support you guys are giving me i, I like it I'm, I'm starting to enjoy this whole youtube video making right so uh, this is this is the track I just hope no cars are going to come down here. Oh, I like it. You can't see around the corner. It's very exciting. It just handles so well. Oh, let me take that tree. The only thing I've got to say, my bad points with the car is where it's not got too much power. You've got to make sure you, you keep the accelerator all the way down. But yeah, I've got to say this is one of my most favourite drift cars in the game up to now. But this series is all about finding new drift cars, drifting home and seeing which one my favourite is. So... I'm going to do one last drift. I've got to get that photo finish. <laughs> so guys, that's going to, I'm going to end the video there. Um, if you did like the video, please leave a like. Uh, subscribe if you want to see more content like it and comment down below for my next build you want to see me do this is substantial it signing out bye